to set an assignment for your students. If you look at the tabs across the top, we're looking for assignments. You can see if you have any in drafts, any that are currently assigned or any that have been marked. So to create a new one, we're going to go to create and you can either choose from an existing assignment that you've already issued, a forms quiz, or you can set an assignment um, that can either be like a Word document or PowerPoint or something that you want to attach. So we're going to go for assignment. So we want to give it a title. You can enter instructions um, for your students. So you can obviously give more instructions um, and you can format your text, highlight things, use bullet points or add any links. And then we can add resources. So if you've got a worksheet or another type of file that you want to add, you can either do that from your OneDrive. You can also connect it to your, your OneNote. If you've got a page in the class notebook that you want to distribute to your class, you can do that as well. Or you can add a link or we can upload from this device. So I'm going to upload it from a device. I'm going to go for this one here and do open. And then it's attached that file for me. Now, there's two different views we can have. If you want um, students only to be able to view that document, then leave it as students can't edit. I want them to be able to put their answers onto this document. So I'm going to put the students edit their own copy. You can decide at this point if you want to give it any points. So you can allocate marks. Or you can add a rubric as well. So if you've got um, a, a plan for how many points you want to allocate, depending on if they've completed certain criteria, you can add that as well. Down at the bottom here, you can pick the team that you want to assign it to, whether it's going to go to all students, and you've got the date that it's due and the time that it's due. Now you can edit that as well. So if I go into edit, you can set assignments to be scheduled for in the future. Um, so if we want to do that, then I could change it from the post date to being Friday and at nine o'clock and then the due date I could make the following Monday. If you want, you can also set a close date for your assignment and um, if you want it to close at that point and not allow students to be able to edit anything anymore. And then all you have to do is schedule.